All right, everybody. So last time we had a very exciting cliffhanger. Uh, essentially, the Grey Tempest is uh, unleashed upon the world, and they are uh, destroying everything. Like it's crazy. Um, whoa! <laughs> and the um, uh, the Synthoids are winning the war. Uh, not as I'm catching up. Like, if I can get sell status quo before they force me to, like, surrender or whatever, that'd be good. Um, because I don't want to get deleted by the Synthoids. Now, we've come so far, you know, we can't, we can't end like this. Um, the galaxy is going to be very empty by the time, uh, we deal with this Great Tempest, though, so it's going to be super interesting. I, I suspect they're just going to, like, spread out from here. And here, and and like basically any empire around here and here can kiss their butt goodbye. They're they're all gonna get wiped out, um, including me. <laughs> I, I don't. There's an anomaly here. What? Okay. Well. Oh, you died. Okay. Um. Get a resilient dude and and. It's an anomaly. Let's research that. Interesting. So, I, I would love to go after this Void Spawn that the um, almost got killed. Kind of cool to get that. But our fleet was absolutely just demolished by the Synthoids. Um, it was kind of dumb. I, there, there were things I could have done to prevent that. Um, like, for example, I, I could have done an edict, like, uh-oh, fleet combat, where? Um, Tempest Shall, uh-oh, if this falls, it's going to fall. I think this is a game. See, if this falls, then, um, my fleet just isn't ready because my fleet got wiped out. Oh, that's that's really bad. Yeah, um shoot. That's it. That right there is the end of the game. Yeah. Um, because now they can run straight up into all of our territory. We can't do a thing to stop them. God, uh, oh man. Um, I don't know. Sometimes the AI does silly things. Sometimes they will, like, the... If, if they charge in with the 30k fleet straight to Earth, I would lose right now. Um, but sometimes they'll, like, they'll pop in, they'll kill a station, then they'll go to the next one. And I'm thinking we might, we might have a, 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 a very small chance of survival. Provided that we... Um, Yeah, yeah, we can downgrade this because there's... Well, I mean, uh, we'll leave it up, but they're going to wreck it anyway. Um, so, we have a very small chance of survival. If we can get enough alloys to fortify here... Yeah, oof. Because they're going to they're gonna take all this stuff. My fleet absolutely needs to be improved. It's it, This is getting kind of bad. Um... So, <laughs> oh man, this this might be the final episode of the series, everybody. I don't know. Um, I I did a bad thing opening that portal. Hey, yeast is uh, order restored because that matters. Oh, I have no governor. Jesus. Okay. Let's um. Well, admin cap is atrocious, so I guess we're going to get you. Um. Okay, Luna, speaking of admin cap, the whole purpose of building this place was to get administrative offices. So let's do just that. I can also clear the radioactive wasteland. And good. Um, as for Mercury, Mercury just got 
founded. What was it doing with Mercury? Um, maybe another alloy plant. I'm not 100% on, on why I settled Mercury. But we'll probably need it because I think Xeon is going to get eaten. In fact, I'm going to... I'm going to stop improving Xeon and Grenier. They're they're good stations, but they are outside of the safety zone. So the safety zone is going to be I fortify Hell's Maw. Wegmore is going to be a just crazy bastion, and the uh, same with Latiran. And I try to build up a navy and outlast the uh, Great Tempest while the Great Tempest eats everybody else. <laughs> um, and maybe that's how we win this game. Maybe, um, I mean, the refugee crisis that this is going to trigger is going to be pretty pretty nice, I gotta say. But we definitely need alloy production to get much higher than it currently is. So hopefully we can get going on the Mega Forges. What are we missing? Um, All must be true. Requires planter capital on the plant. So that will happen at when? This is number of pops is greater than or equal to 40. Okay. So it's going to take a little while to get to the that stage. But in the meantime, just keep filling uh, these in. Can only support seven districts. Oh, really? Well, okay. It's fine, though. It's fine. You're a Gaia world, and you'll have a lot of pop coming in. Um, Trident should be okay for that. I, I guess you can be another Forge world. Yeah, because I need more. So. Also, in terms of... Fortifying, I, I could get... A habitat and fortify that. Well, I need the alloys. Let's focus on alloy production. Let's see. Next, absorbers, peace tree. Slowly but surely, the acceptance is going to tick up for this. So hopefully it happens before we're forced to surrender to them. Just keep building. Just keep building. Research oh, I really should have done that edict. I probably would have won that war with, that, with it. Um, gamma laser. I... I I thought I already had gamma lasers. Wow. Uh, sure. Yeah. Oh, you can build a moat thing, and we need them. So. Mo moat, mo better. Okay. Um. I'd like to take out this void spawn, but I think it's going to heal up before I get a chance to get down there. And I do not want my fleet to be caught out. That would be very bad. Oh, oh, relic activation. I could do this. Done. Done. Zarkon wills it. Okay, that should change this situation a bit. Yeah. Let me look at my new fleet. That is 6.4k. <laughs> oh, amazing. Um, I don't really want this. It's a good way to lose ships. I guess... Resilient. Sure. But the crews are operational. So... With this... Maybe I could take this out. Oh, I'm, I'm so nervous about that, though. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm just, well, I'm worried I will overextend, go out here, lose, and then, like, I, I'm out of alloys and stuff again. I think I need to be cautious here. Um, your home base can be, um... Bernard Star. Yeah, go home to your, your home base. As for Bernard Star, I should probably upgrade that. 